Okay, so my daughter got homework today. Mommy, can you pick me up? And it's called Sink or Float Science, and she did some at school, different objects, and they guessed whether they'd sink or float, and then found out what it did. So, ugh, she got another sheet to do home, and we had to make up our own things and guess if they would sink or float. So, we picked, let me read your list, a wooden block, and Haley thought it would float, a key, she thought would float a business card, she thought would float a stone, she thought would sink, a sock, she thought would float, a piece of dog food, she thought would sink, and a piece of candy, she thought would sink. So we got a bowl here, first we got to fill it up with water. Okay, first up is a piece of dog food. You think it will sink, you said. Let's see. Put it in there. What's it doing? Okay, so the dog food floated. So that's this piece of dog food. And you thought it was going to sink, but what did it do? Whoa. Floated. So Haley's going to put an F for float. Okay, next one we'll do is a piece of candy. Okay, Haley, what's next? A thing. What's it doing? Floating. Yep, you said float, and it's floating, so I put an F next to float. Ooh. Do you think it's going to sink or float? Float. Yep, that floats. Okay, next we're doing a key. And Haley thought that this key would float. Donk. Is that floating? Oh, oh, oh. Nope, that is flying right to the bottom. Next, we're borrowing a sock from Haley's brother. And okay. Haley thinks it'll float. And it will float. Float. Last one is our stone that we think is going to sink. Go ahead. Yep. We're all right that it sunk. Okay, so we're done, and her homework got a little wet, but she got one, two, three, four right that she thought was going to float or sink. So try this at home. It's fun. The kids like it. You guys have fun? Yeah. Yeah. Okay.